tunasikiza tuna tuko kwa show mm. but na generalize mm. so what i'm getting from you we need this e active e yenye unafanya kila siku unapata ndo then if possible have both yes. have passive yes. unarusha pia kando unarusha kando inakumekia unaona hiyo chama utaengeaje kama una do so mu semanga mm. unaje venye tunabanga kwa na emergency fund because you don't know what will happen yeah. put your money in a money market msa kwa msik within two days you can put your money out can is school fees within two days you can pull your money out sasa tofauti ya money market na government of kenya government of kenya uke ka money for one year. one year you can't withdraw yeah and then also entry entry ya government of kenya 100000 entry ya money market 1000 na oh. ile kitu mupe na money market unafungwa tu account yako unafungwa account unaeka pesa na um, mpesa sasa zile kwanza venye mu jambia mimi mwenyewe i've got to make my nails you have spent how much i'm like did i need to do that no therefore tuma pesa kwa money market want to change my nail polish uh-huh. like every now and then yes. sana nikakaa nikajiuliza na kutengeneza hizo kucha ni 35 uh-huh. is it a need ama is it a want okay. it is a want it's i want, want to have a yes, different yes, color yes yes okay yes uh, that's yeah, true but it's not a need hapo ndo niliachana nazo eh sasa unafanya nga i like say it's funny kama want uh-huh. nafanya when it's a need when it's a need eh ah. when when aki i need to make this nails zimechapa okay. eh. si yule i want another color okay yes no. yes yes i like that i yeah. like that perspective eh. and that's a hard thing for ladies because you're like do i need hair Nimejaribu. do i need makeup Nimeweza. do i need dresses true that's how you think about eh. it and do i need a wig Mm-mm. i want Mm-mm. i don't need it Mm-mm. me comes at the last week nilienda nikadai ni i cut it short then i dyed it because i had that you know when you start doing this and you're teaching people you also have true. to be accountable yeah. so ni ndani nikachukua ili kwa imezeka kidogo nikaongeza tu bundle moja i cut it and i dyed it hey it looked like a Ufia. fresh new thing guys are like hey. and then i discovered a lady in town and i'm just like because you're like surely uh, if i want it i'll pay over 100k True. but this minor changes very little money because you want it but you can't yes uh, yes okay i love that one so tuko na income yes so na expenses na tuko na expenses sasa kwa hii expenses uki budget ile kitu watu ufanya you spend so much money on every day na za woman yo nimenunua groceries nini nini ndudhi mlipa ndupto ndudhi watu wao wachukuliwa oh unapeleka watu lunch eh umewapeleka weekend etc lakini what people don't do savings are investment why can't you save imagine i can't afford ukiangalia hiyo budget yako utapata studio tuma how much ya mazishi ulituma how much ya medical bill studio tuma how much ya watu wa ushago hakuna shida ya hiyo budget ni kusema eka sili Mm. How much am I giving people 10%? Because if you don't give yourself, if you don't save and invest for yourself, lifestyle yako itakaje on your 60. Na tusema ah mimi sasa nikafika 60. Sele, statistics za Kenya. Tunasema nga there's a 77% chance you will get to 80. Meaning at 80 you'll still be here god willing. Na how to save? No to save, no to invest. Hebu fanya 80 minus your current age. Oh tuachia hapo tuachia hapo so after budgeting eh, lazima usi no hata ngoja kabla ya kusave how many years are, how many decades then are you planning your money for five exactly five or six exactly yeah, yeah so when you think about it like that when someone is telling you save and invest you're not doing it because it's a tedious task just like eh hey, sele in ana 50 60 years nisipoweka do zangu vipoa nitakuwa vibaya sana na when size umezoea lifestyle na hizi do zako kama ukuweka kwa active haziku tengenezei Actively hauna kitu na kutengeneza exactly hauna kitu na kutengenezea exactly hauna so at the bare minimum you have to save 10% if you can't stretch yourself and say another 10% i'll put it for investments save kwa na emergency fund 10% of your income yes 10% has to because what you're doing is first you have to build an emergency fund. Mm-hmm. So emergency fund open a money market account. Ka kuna do inaingianga 10% yende kwako. So unalipanga tax. Mm-hmm. Do you negotiate on tax? Mm-hmm. Tax has to see yako, mm-hmm. but for your future self, see 10% has to go to an emergency fund. If you're young and hauna familia, imagine you can even try and push to even 30%. Like I was thinking about myself in my 20s. Mm-hmm. So you'd have been easily able True. to save 30%. True. Mm-hmm. But sasa hatatukua na income wengine wetu in 20s. Sasa <laughs> tungesave nini? Ni sawa. Tulikuwa mia hapa kwa income. Ni sawa tu. So here's the thing. Mm. 
salary yako mm. 10% ya kwanza ni ile ya Mungu mm. Ushaba baki na 90% mm. mm. budget zako ni ka 80 mm. 80% mm. alafu na 10% ya kusave lazima 10% to save lazima us 10% you either to save, save or invest yes. ama you do both saving and inve- so savings and investment saving you put money aside it doesn't earn a return investment earns you a return so put it in a money market it will earn you a return okay. it's near it's like a savings lakini unajua ukiweka savings account una earn zero eh ukiweka money market una earn 8 to 10% aha so weka kwa money market okay sasa hapo nimekupata mm. ehe uh-huh. and then after saving haya after saving sema sasa um uko na pension mi hatuna vijana wengi hatuko by the way mika misiko okay na tu mm-hmm. pension na iki barua yangu mbithe ndani hata mimi hapa hivi niko peke yangu baby sile mimi niko na wewe but i'm talking to your future self at the age of 80 but who I... needs the pension so 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 what you're telling me is what i'm doing for myself now 10% you see the thing is you if you're not employed do you know the investments like the infrastructure bond that can give you pension because pension ah. is putting money aside for the future Then what you want to do with pension junior selewa uko 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 unataka kitu long term na nikikufa kitu hautashika si utachia family yako watawapata uko sure uko sure watawapatia unless you <laughs> less, and let, let me ask you do you think you'll be a Kenyan living in Kenya in 20 years yes so so then the government will be there and operating so you're telling me i can i can i can save for my own pension yes But if what okay so now this is what I was thinking mm. me mm. pension yangu jo nilijua kitambo si kwa pension mm. mi najipanga kivyangu hebu najipangaje kama hiyo money market uh-huh. even ndo nimefikiria uh-huh. like even ndo vitu najipanga which is okay see that is okay that's okay but the issue is sele what happens with that you see pension needs to be like something that's 15 years and more emergency yote kitokea jo kwa oh, money market it's very quick to kutoa hiyo unaelewa uh-huh. that's the issue So you are saving and investments that is for anything else. So umeweka hiyo tena hapo. Sasa tumesema tena nyingine umetolea Mungu. What mm. we are trying to say is tena nyingine jiweke huko kando Yo kando kando ya uzeni. Ya uzeni. Jukeka kama infrastructure bond it's a very good product tax free. Hakuna tax unachajiwa. Inakupea about 12.5%. Mhm. Na ni ya 19 years. Unajua hiyo sasa utakutana nayo huko ukiwa? Ah ni ya 19 years. Yes, it's a nine, there's a current one that's alive. So if I start doing it now nitaanza kula pension yangu kwanza 50 years. No wanakupeanga return every year but ile pesa umeweka utarudishiwa in 20 years. In sorry in 19 years. In 19. So let me let's work with an example. The minimum investment ni 100,000. Mm-hmm. So ukiweka 100,000 gava itakwenda kupatia 12.5% every year. Ah, okay. That's 12,500. That, uh-huh. Lakini na kulipanga mara mbili after 6 months. 6565. Yes, 6565 there uh-huh. about. Uh-huh. Every 6 months. Then after 19 years you get back your initial investment of 100,000. Mm-hmm. So what I say for pension for personal, why you use infrastructure bond? What you say? Put 10% of the income that you get aside. Sindio? Tuseme mtu ana 100. Weka 10% aside. Sita kuchukua 10 months kufika 100. Mm-hmm. Ukifika 100, tafuta infrastructure bond, weka pesa zako hapo. So hii ndio pesa utanipatia after 19 years. Hai zai? No, inaza. Si wamekuwa kinirudishia eh, every year. Every year. So unajua 12.5 what where is your phone? 100 ah. divided by 12.5. Uh, so here's the thing. No, uh, hand, uh, let's do 100 divided by someone 100 divided by 12.5 to show you how many times your money doubles. It doubles more than 3 times. So are they going to give the already washani patia 12.5 yearly? Eh kila mwezi kila mwe kila mwaka kitu cha 12.5. Like wana nipatia ama wana nipishe kwa hiyo account. Wanakupea and then you una decide ku reinvest. Oh that was my so question. So in other words if you start with 100,000 over a 19 year period your money has grown by 3 times. Eh sababu mekuja. Hiyo ni 300k. Eh 8. 8 times. So pesa yako ina every 8 years your dough comes your money comes back. Payback. So nikiweka 100,000 hii mm-hmm. the after first 8 years ni, eh, after 8 years sina lipo 12.5% yes. kila mwaka uh-huh. so by year 8 a hundred yangu ya first itakuwa isharudi so uko na so mbili sasa after 8 years no 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 uko na 100 after 8 years plus ile yako ngoja yako uja get yako uh-huh. na get on 19 years uh-huh. so year 
ume get your 100 jume ko kipa 12.5 12.5 si ndio mm-hmm. we go for another 8 years year 16 mm-hmm. ushapewa you another 100 yosi mm-hmm. ni 200 mm-hmm. haya alafu year 19 so utakuwa umekula uh, interest for half of yeah. that period say half say for utakuwa ume get 50k mm-hmm. ume get 250 mm-hmm. alafu the 19th year una get your 100 so ume make 350 from 100. Okay. So from 100 we get 350 mm. return. So that's over three times. Mm. And that's you have put 100,000 shillings over a 19 year period. That's I think very good money, but the trick is ima za wana kupea reinvest kwa government. Exactly. Na kiswa lingine watu usema si afadhali ni yake real estate. Tunasemanga real estate in Nairobi ukienda ku buy house ni gani utabai na 100 sijui. But just in case upatio ya 100 inakupeanga return ya about 9%. Hizi za outskirts za suburban areas hizi za Mlolongo zinakupea 9%. Labda ukipata watu mfanye mabati una get 15%. But ujui kama kutakuwa mtu ndani ujui kama atatoka. Mm. So unapata hiyo return ya 12.5 versus real estate unaweza ukaeka doza kwa hapo na hiyo iko hiyo retirement plan. And the in minimum investment ni 100. So semi at stage ni kaeka money aside for retirement juu sijafikisha hizo mm. millions. Sio kama hiyo na make sense. Nimeona nimekuona eh nimekuget. Na hiyo hautashika. Lakini a mm. a uh-uh. mm nimekuget mm. lakini pale kwa, <laughs> kwa? pale kwa 100 yeah. after 19 years hapo yeah. nitakuona kando okay. yeah. no but new lease 100 no. after 19 years no 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 like my own personal view see mm. ni... <laughs> no but i want to hear but you see, no i'm just saying yeah. as for me yes i'd rather go to a money market okay but what's the difference selling Money market sina kupea tena. Sina the same after hey. 19 years nitapata 350 250. Hey. No, uta hii nyingine unapata 350. Si ndio? This mm-hmm. is how you calculate return. No, I'm just saying, hey. okay, this is my point. I'm hey. just saying I th- for me, hey. not for the viewers. Yes. I think there's a better. Yes. A better one. Kama government bond. Mhm. 10% mm-hmm. per yes. year. Per year. I think it's better. Yes. Ama so select then yanasema for planning unajua kitu ya investments pick an investment to meet a need you see oh. like for pension because you're putting money away for retirement you want to look for an investment ya yeah, long term na inakupea 12.5 si ndio uh-huh. haya government bond ya yeah, 10 year gives you about 11.5% mm-hmm. if you invest with the government for one year 10. you get 10% so your strategy can be I'll invest for one year I get 10% and I reinvest. Yeah. You see now like such a, an investment opportunity allows you to fund things like school fees for your children or if I want to buy a house or nataka kujenga compound interest. If I keep putting my money by year 7, nitakuwa nimetengeneza do kibao like too much money mm-hmm. because if I start with like 100,000 every year and I keep reinvesting at about 12% in government that one year bond in about 10 years I'll have 26 million. Mm-hmm. I can do so much more. So the thing is to say there are so many opportunities it's like every opportunity meets a different need true so banya najaribu kusema ni sale ukiaka hii money market for retirement you can pull it out anytime ujifanye ni emergency but retirement is guaranteed haita wai toka hata wai toka so you're trying to say either ni chukue pension plan individual lakini ju- see, i don't have that opportunity maybe because i'm not employed i can take a pension product or i can use an investment product in the market the infrastructure bond to plan for my retirement. So, now I get you. I mm. think I need both. Yes, you need both. All of them pl- play all money market, one year government bond in your portfolio, na infrastructure ah. bond. So tutaka kupea vitu tatu kwa investment portfolio yako. Kama mbili. Sasa tuko money market na infrastructure bond. Eh. But unaona sasa money m- eh, exactly you are retire your pension. Eh, pension exactly. sasa ni infrastructure. Yes. Alafu umesema money market ni ya regular savings. Yes. Sawa sawa. Sasa so, tuko na mbili already. Eh. Mm-hmm. Sasa swali yangu iko hapa. Mm. Niko na income mm-hmm. nimefanya budget mm-hmm. nimefanya um, savings mm-hmm. actually niko hapa nimefanya budget mm-hmm. kwa hii budget kuna malipo ya fuliza mm-hmm. kuna malipo ya debt yes. eh, kuna malipo ya mobile loans yes. mobile loans yes. sijui nini wale wanapiganga okay. oh easy loans unajua nani unajua huyu mtu aliweka wewe kama garanta mm-hmm. <laughs> you know mm-hmm. like even how part yet a pesa ya ku save yes because i have to pay fuliza then fuliza yes like ndo nilipe mama mboga lazima nilipe fuliza then nimfulizie kwanza nanyamazisha huyu we compo 
oh, tulia tulia akitulia kidogo nafulizia huyo wiki okay na hii ni swali ya maana sana mm-hmm. why come back to you have to budget ni lazima ujiulize mbona unashinda ngo ukifuliza It's one thing to see nimefuliza for groceries lakini ukibudget ukijiangalia hii mwezi ya January nimekuwa nikifuliza juu ya nini akimfuliza wanafuliza fuliza nguo wananipea pesa nzuri asanteni sana okay hey wanani <laughs> wana hata siezi waachili what are, what are your fuliza needs what do you use fuliza for so by the way na kwa mahali kama hapa mm. tuseme for example eh, kuna kitu kuna emergency mm-hmm. niseme ah badla ya kwanza kuingia sijui kwanza kuwasha data sijui kuni wacha tunifulize like fuliza is part of me mm. i don't feel even mm. okay well kuna siku ni feel vibani nilitumua pesa ikamezo yote nikashindwa kwani hiyo interest ya fuliza <laughs> inakaaje yes eh like ilienda yote nikashindwa nimetumua do imeenda mm. but part of me feels like ni pesa yangu mm. you know mm. i have it mm. niki naweza kuambia sasa hii niko na Let's say 15k. Yeah. Now your 15k ni fuliza. Like I count it as my money. Your, it contributes to your debt. <laughs> yes. Siezi sikia home. <laughs> hakuna maji ya kunywa. Yeah. Mtu wa bodani mwambie come yeah. kimbilia maji mm. at nikose kufuliza. Mm. Like for me fuliza feels like unaweza kapa hivi hauna shopping kwa nyuma na uko na fuliza. Ngoja kidogo. Ebuji buyo swali. Unaweza kapa hivi na uko na fuliza na hauna chakula. Mimi na budget so mimi na fuliza tu kwa marafiki sana. How fuliza ngi? I try not to because na juanga bay hiyo debt unajua debt ya fulizi na kwanga expense. But then how much ata sijua. Na kwanga expensive because it depends on what platform you're using but mobile loans can cost you between 8 to 10% in a month if not more. Oh me I'm talking of the real fuliza the safari. They even the, that fuliza all of them all your mobile loans anything between 8 to 10% or if not more which means if you take 10,000 shillings you probably end up paying 10,000 uh, you pay, end up paying 11,000. What do you mean? Yeah. Check you. Wana ni kulanga 1000 extra. I will not put any money. I don't know about for the the specific for No, food, but for real, the I mobile don't know platforms, the mobile platforms charge you anything between 8 to 10% What? per month. And then there's also a facilitation fees. Uh-huh. So yes people fullies and we fullies a lot of money we fullies a billion because it's shillings. easy it's very it's easy. easy it's very easy but this is how i want you to look up at debt in first and foremost easy vitu mbili tunaongea so unasema kuna income ina kama mm-hmm. si unajua kwani inatokanga mm-hmm. at least you have a sense of how much kujaza si ndio sasa so, tukasema kitu ya pili sale easy expenses zote unalipianga zina change ingi has it changed has it changed actually, actually zinaongezeka zinaongezeka yeah. lakini unazijua umezi allocate categories sijazi eh. well na, kuna zile zile zina repeat monthly na zile na, zin, eh, eh. na umezi so unajua ni how much una spend exactly. kila mwezi si ndio exactly. na unajua ile do ina kama hata hazitoshi <laughs> kuna moja na zipo ngoja hata kabla tungefuliza <laughs> unajua how much una spend kila mwezi yes. si ndio yes. na unajua ile do ina kama so either utaenda uongeze ile do una earn from income tuseme uko na sell sales wigs brands for example or sell sell something else ju sell us profile hiyo bucket ya income ndio kwa sababu unarudi kwa fuliza ukisuspo uspo nini hiyo sasa venye unasema wewe your source of income has become debt but debt is costing you do you know there's a time niliondoka nili left uh-huh. niliwalipa na nika left alafu ah, nikarudi nilijipata mahali manzi ah nikarudi haraka <laughs> sana cuz for me uh-huh. atas feeling ni card mm. like me I feel like it's my money mm hata hata nikifuliza ishe hata mm. nikiwalipa sinenga ubaya mm. nitafuliza tu tena okay. like hiyo ndo life yetu hiyo ni sawa basi but what but i normally say the interest i didn't know interest. the thing is with that from a financial planning perspective there two ways is it good or bad denile na kujenga nile unaenda kufanya investment na inakupatia return higher than the cost of debt mm-hmm. so for instance ifanya tukua tunasema active income kama nafuliza ama nachukua nini hizi mobile loans na labda nalipa hiyo 10% lakini ndanda ni buy bidha niuze ni make double mm. tuseme nichukue 10,000 alafu niuze ni make 20,000 Makes sense. Hakuna shida. Unajua ukiangalia hizi statistics za mobile lending zina kuanga vitu mbili. Kuna wale wase uborongi Monday to Friday ngware 4 AM. By 6 washarudisha hiyo do. Ni wale wa traders, watu wa mama mboga huku mm. downtown juu wana borrow ku buy stock alafu wanauza. But aki si atashindi hapo. Wana lakini unajua mother aki akinunua aki, aki, aki chukua deni ya 10,000 and and make 20,000 hata wewe oh. akikulipa hiyo si, si that's not bad debt. Hmm. Imemjengea biashara. Wale wase wengine wanaanza nga Friday 2 PM mpaka Sunday sherehe sherehe so huyo msee umechukua eh umeenda ukabai vitu weekend umefanya shopping umefanya nini hiyo deni imekujenga 
umechukua 10,000 labda umelipa 11,000. Ni what productive use have you used for the day? So that's how you look at debt. I am going to unfollow Fuliza today after <laughs> this. Like I didn't know you were interested in me cut off. There's, there's, a, there's a cost to everything. So when you're thinking about debt, sale, whichever debt, vitu mbili, julize, hii deni ni kichukua, utalipia. Na utalipia mm. haya. Na un, unajuliza, am I using it kujenga biashara? Ka unajenga biashara by all means, sale. Go for it. Kama ntenda chukua. Kama unajenga familia yangu, kama hakuna maji. Wee enda ukatafute income. Oh, hiyo ni, hiyo ni, oh, hiyo si afuliza. Hii network yako endo ujue juice unajua tuseme expenses zako ni 50k si ndio mm. na unajua ile do una making regular ni 30 so unajua kila mwitu, mwezi unataka 20 sele if you don't find something to fill that gap in terms of income utako unafuliza 20000 na utako unafuliza 20000 na una make am say another do so ni wewe decide mimi nataka kole mse i walk around so you know you need to buy water is it a surprise Sometimes to buy water is like, a surprise. Like here's the thing. Yeah. Maji inaisha anga init. Nika gas. Sasa leo unahitaji inaisha. But hiyo ndo nakwambia sele hii budget yako utafine kila mwezi lazima ubuy gas. Kila mwezi. I buy gas like after three months. After three which means you know in three mm. months you see when you're doing your budgets it's a tedious process sele but what it's helping get you into your mind is to tell you when was the last time I bought gas so that I know next month gas mm. is coming. So I'm asking myself how much is my income coming? Yes I'm in the business world but what can I sell? How can I actually ensure that at a bare minimum I'm spending less than I'm earning? That's what we are trying to get into. So when it comes to financial planning, it's not the big things. It's just the small little things. Where is my money coming from? Is it enough? If it's not enough, how do I increase it? Where is my money going? Do I know I need to be able to track my spending patterns so that I can be able to separate what is a want and what is a need? Third thing is now on debt. What is good debt? What is bad debt? If you have to take the debt, that's okay. No, it comes at a cost. Mm. Good debt ni ile unatumia kufanya biashara na inakujenga. Hii ingine ya kufanya consumption ya sherehe, it's good for you. And it's unfortunate that in this country we use debt mm. to actually do more sherehe. Yeah. Imagine kikangu kwambia so ni fund biashara yangu. Tunaambia ai na utanipotezeaje? Mm. We don't support businesses in that regard. But Then the final yeah. thing is now investments. So people want to know about investments. You but you have to Juliza, am I willing? Yes. Am I able to? No. Is eh. you don't sasa unaona so si ati kitu moja separate. Ju wase wanataka nga eh hey, mazi I want to have you seen this investment in and you're like it's good. Are you able to invest? No. Okay fine. If you're able to invest then these are the options. You can invest locally, you can invest out there. But what I say like for this investments that we've discussed, it's important to understand um risk and return. High risk, high return. Low risk, low return. The next thing ni kujuliza kama nimefanya kazi yote. What am I trying to meet? Unaona kama umesimama ni market juu unataka ngaa surplus zako unaweka hapo mm. na uko na plans labda hii mwaka nataka kufanya X by December. Maybe I want to do certain projects in December. You said you have kids, your family. You know like in two or three years it may be go to a higher grade and it becomes more expensive. So for you you're channeling your money market funds to meet your emergency needs, to meet your short term project needs. Tukasema there are other investments that can help you address your retirement needs. Na hata hapa katikati unataka hata kwenda holiday unajua ukiweka hiyo 1 million au 100,000 you're not thinking hard. Mm-hmm. So don't leave your money in a savings account and it's earning zero. Peleka money market. Kila do ukipata peleka money market. Kwa uko na biashara you only need two days. Una withdraw hiyo pesa unaenda kufanya vitu vingine. So let your investments actually meet your financial needs and the most important thing so let think about it. Imagine ufike 80 When you start thinking I have 4 or 50 or 60 years to plan then your decisions become a little bit different. Do you see hapa unacheza Leo kesho unajuliza this brand that you have built what more can you do to extend it so that what you're doing actually enhances revenue. Then you begin to ask in terms of income what are the other opportunities beyond the shows that you're doing. You deliberate with the people around you and ask how much more can we do with what we have and once we do that how can I be able to put more money aside so that it's actually working for me for the longer term. I think maybe that's an interesting way of thinking about it. It is it mm. is hapo kwanza that. money working for me because mm. i think hapo ndo tunafaa tu ile at fake fanya kazi ya the 80 wizi hai madam hata wengine hata wengine watakuwa shaka na shows zingine Mm-mm. na kinambi za mm-hmm. wengine mm-hmm. but thank you so much mbide mm-hmm. personally mm-hmm. stories zako zote zinaweza kuwa mm-hmm. 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 thank you so much mbide personally story ya doni white hata ni heavy sasa hivi umeongea naanza kuangalia guy ni unfollow fuliza 
ama like mm. it is heavy mm. in a need in a need pe uamue because mm. Wenye tu hizo points nne mm. zinafuatana tu mm. kuna msizi ya ndafuta job mm. of which najua atapata mm. like endelea tu kujituma usi, mm. usi, usi kufe moyo mm. but kuna msizi bado ako zile za walai zile pesa nime waste uh, ukifikiri okay, ningekuwa nafanya ke, eh ningekuwa nafanya Kenya mbi there anasema cause wase tunapiga sherehe tunapiga sherehe sherehe we, we tunapiga. jitume kwanza leo na no, no, no upange eh hata ukipiga sherehe kachupa kamoja ibu weka kwa mani mato imagine hivyo ndo mkoza watu wale watu wanakunyoga ya bia msema ngata shares msema yani if you drink a beer Rafiki, nunua, nunua share ya EBL. It is the same price as your beer. Ina kwa ngapo like 160, 170, 180. A beer is like 200 and more. So I'm like kama unajituma sherehe, weka hapo utapata mazao. Unapata eh eh you get a dividend. You open an account. And also even beyond that. I know when you say it's overwhelming, it's a very overwhelming conversation to have understanding where you are. But if you don't understand where you are, then you can't plan. So in fact what we normally do tunakuangana hizi workshops na hizi tunataka kufanya workshop ya women and money. Nice. So just to demystify what are these things because we find with women she does not kuanga financial and investment planning. Mm-hmm. He kujipanga. So what frameworks can I use kujipanga? How can I think kujipanga? So we want to have like a half day workshop tunaongea hizi vitu zote lakini pia tuna unatoka hapo na plan ukijua how should I think about my money? where am i investing and what are the options available for me and why we say that is sometimes una patanga in a market there are so many people who are telling you different things but for sure. us we come as an independent voice because we are not representing anyone we are giving you information that helps you that empowers you that builds you and with these workshops and the templates that we give you you have a plan kazi yako tu ni kwa amend once or twice in a year unasema hivi ndio unaka hivi ndio unataka kukaa na kitu kingine ya maana sana mhm kuongeza vitu na watu wenyu nyumbani true you know just finding a way because what you find kama mzee analipa rent na analipa eh, school, fees. school fees na unalipa hizo vitu zingine na zinaongezeka bei na zitaongezeka bei sana hii mwaka juu ya elections yani una spend kidogo na labda una spend more than him so if you don't find a way to have pictorials and say eh sweetheart even the truth How can we actually now start operating as a family and try and do things together even though we are not putting money together what can our five big things be how do we want to think about income how do we want to think about investments our, about our expenses can we share na jo kuna hata clients wetu wanaenda ngani ni a gm and of year ni menda sherehe sg costo wao wanasema ndio tuko sherehe lakini friday morning half day to co workshop me and my bae to eh. discuss no me this is what i spend i don't think it's fair i should spend less so you present your numbers then you have a conversation as a family that helps you now move forward so that what you're doing you're building wealth for yourself you're building wealth for your children you're building wealth for future generations but it all has to start with a plan and you don't focus on what you don't have focus on what you have and then ask yourself what can i do to move forward mm. thank you so much at least hata najua kuna mtu amesaidika sana kuna mtu atakukujia akuja kulizembite now me shida yangu ni hii na hii na hii i hope you get to help them yes ya watakwambia umetoka kwa sales reflection so i hope you get to help them okay yeah and my handle just before you end it's at mbithe mwema so uh-huh. niko facebook instagram twitter linkedin mbithe mwema ask mbithe i'm available anytime we are going to put it here down okay. here so video asante mbithe mwema handle yake kila kitu mm. personally mimi nakuja hata mm. nakuona tu sai tukikati tu nakuuliza maswali mbili tatu but thank you so much guys thank you for coming to our show See you next week on Celeste Reflection. Bye bye.